Hey everyone and welcome to the Mr. Hayden YouTube channel. If you don't know who I am, my name's Hayden, obviously, and I've been selling for around four and a half years now. I've done way over a million in sales and uh, yeah, I've got a PPC agency as well. We help people with that stuff. I've got multiple team members within my UK and USA store and yeah, we're just selling, selling, selling. So in this video, I'm going to talk to you about why like, you're, you're not making it happen why it's not happening for you in this space. Because a lot of you watching this will either be a couple of months in or a few months in, or even more than like a year in, and you're still struggling to make profit. You're still struggling to get traction in your Amazon business. And that's what I wanna talk about in here, a hard hitting truth about why it's probably not working out for you. So without further ado, let's dive into this video. So. A lot of people, when they start this business, expect it to be something that is going to be easy money. They expect it to be easy money, something that is just going to set up and somehow you're going to get it to a stage where it completely automates itself. Uh, you're going to be sitting on the beach in Bali and just sipping your cocktails and it's going to be making you money. Or maybe some sort of guru upsold you into a course believing that and you're sort of holding on to that. I'm here to destroy that to destroy that reality, that, that non-truthful reality, but also give you the reality of what you're going to have to expect from now on. This business model is never going to be, if you want to consistently make good profits and have a business that is actually sustainable and keeping ahead of the competition, unless you want to do tiny, tiny little margins, you're never going to have a business that is completely outsourced in this space. It's just not going to happen. I don't know anyone that still retains good margins that is completely extracted from the business unless they've sold the business. It's just not going to happen, right? So that's the first sort of truth. But having that in mind, knowing that, okay, moving forward, is a very important task for you, okay? Now, knowing that means that we can then move on to the, the, the main problem. And the main problem is either you're not putting in enough work or you just don't know what to do, right? So one, one, one half of people, one selection of people, what they will do is just not put in the work. And they're constantly making excuses, posting on Facebook groups, looking for YouTube videos, perhaps like this one or some of my other ones. And they will constantly be investing in courses, investing in coaches, investing in masterminds, investing in whatever, learning stuff or learning from YouTube, wherever you're doing it, and then not putting in the work, not putting in a level of work that is required for you to figure out if this is gonna work for you or not. And then they will post on Facebook groups, post in their mastermind, post them wherever they are, talk to their coach, and they will say, it's just not working. I can't make it work. And then they turn into a troll when they talk to people on the Amazon communities, or they give it up, they give up, and they just say, look, it doesn't work. Everything gets price tanked, blah, 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 blah. And if you're in that boat, listen up, because that could be you. And it, and it might be a hard hitting truth that you've got to you know, believe it, you, you've got to just admit to in yourselves, guys. You, some people, a lot of people, just don't put in the work that's required. I launch so many products every single week, you wouldn't believe it. And guess what? So many of them products completely flop and they don't work. And guess what? On my arbitrage side of things, we buy about £4,000 a week in arbitrage, just alone in that side of my business. And guess what? Loads of it gets price tanked. But you don't see me moaning about it. Not in any of the Facebook groups. I might do in my, my, my little one-to-ones with uh, coaches or my little masterminds, inner masterminds that we have within ourselves, me and some other big uh, or, or long-term sellers. But you won't see us seriously moaning about it. Why? Because we understand that it's a system. We understand, we understand how this stuff works. We understand it's just a process. It's a system. And more importantly, it's just how things go. It ebbs and flows, okay? So... That's the first lot of people. The first lot of people are just not putting in enough work. And the amount of work you put in is a direct correlation of the results that you're going to get. Because look, here's the truth. You're not going to figure out this stuff until you fail multiple times. And you're not going to figure out this stuff until you constantly test stuff, try stuff, launch products, buy products, and just get that volume in there. Once you get the volume in there, you get momentum following that. And that momentum compounds not just in pound signs, but in your experience and your team's experience and your systems and your processes that you create. And then eventually it just snowballs into this ever moving compounding. Still has issues, still has issues with your stock management. You still have issues with price tanking. You still have issues with products not successfully launching. But you're going to get to a stage in the future where as long as you put enough work in, 
you're going to figure it out. As long as you put enough work in, it's going to get to a stage where 60 to 70% of your efforts give you an ROI, give you a return on investment, give you that profit back to you. And that's the golden ticket there, my friends, once you get it to that stage. But most of you are not putting in enough work and you believe you're putting in enough work, but you're not putting in enough work. You're just not putting in enough work. I'm going to keep saying it. You're not putting in enough work. It's not okay to do a, a, a job and then come home at night, have dinner with your family, do one hour on Amazon and then watch TV for the rest of the evening and then tell people you've got a side hustle you're working on. Like, it's just not going to be enough. And I wish it was. I want you to spend time with your family. I want you to go out. I'm not telling you to, you know, recluse yourself and not go out and enjoy yourself, but you have to make more time. And in the early days, let me tell you, I was working till 12, 1, 2, at, 2, 2 in the morning, like 12 p.m. until 2 a.m. in the morning sometimes, and working from 9, 10, 11 in the morning all the way around there, sitting there, no girlfriend, no social life, no pubs, no bars, unless it was like a random Friday night or something like that, and just whacking it away, bish, bash, bish, 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 just doing it, doing it, doing it, doing the work, doing the work, doing the work. Do, might have had a film in the background, but I was doing the work, doing the work, doing the work, doing the work. It's just a volume of work that you haven't yet got. And until you realise that in yourself, that you're not putting in enough work, you know. Anyone that's not putting enough work is watching this video, and they're, they're looking at what they're doing, they're going, okay, Hayden's right, I'm not putting enough work. You know, don't bullshit yourself. If you're not putting enough work, that's the answer there, okay? Now, the second group of people, so one of you, one of you, one set of people has not been enough work. The second group of people knows what they got to do, right? The, sorry, doesn't know what they got to do. Like they're frantically trying loads of different stuff, loads of different strategies. They're buying a bit of RA, they're buying arbitrage, or they're, or they're doing USA selling, or they're doing bundles, or they're trying to do wholesale, and they're seeing all this training, and they're in these different training groups, and they've got all this stuff going on, and they're getting processed, they're seeing the, the light at the end of the tunnel, they're like, oh my god, that's how these guys do it, you know, that's how Hayden does it, that's how Natalie does it, that's how we make it work, but... It's not an issue with you not putting enough work. You guys might be trying to do everything at once because that's what I was like, trying to do everything at once. And you were trying to be, you were, you were trying to have your toes in all things. Oh, some people are selling internationally. Let's do that. Some people are doing arbitrage in the UK. Let's do that. Oh, wholesale. Yeah, let's do that. You know, oh, let's, let's, let's do everything under the sun. Let's do bundles. Let's do unique bundles. You know, let's do, uh, oh, I'm going to do bundle threes, fours and fives because I don't want to miss out on anything. And then you're overwhelming yourself with too much stuff. And this can have just as much of an effect of the people that are not doing any work at all. So when you're, when you're in this stage, you've got to really align with focus. Let me tell you, the first year and a half of me in, in Amazon, I did nothing but online arbitrage. Absolutely nothing. I didn't touch anything else, didn't think about anything else. I just got good at online arbitrage. And guess what happened at the end of that year and a half, guys? You guessed it. I got good at online arbitrage and we were making profit. Was it the profit I wanted? No, but were we making profit? Yes, we learned every single mistake we need to learn. And then what I did is I switched into unique bundles overnight, transitioned completely into unique bundles, right? And guess what happened? I stuck to that and I didn't do anything for another year and a half, maybe even two years, at least a year and a half. I didn't do anything but unique bundles in the UK, in one marketplace. I stuck to it. And now I'm at a stage where I've leached onto the, uh, leached onto the um, previous experience I had with online arbitrage, and I've actually set up a new model in a different country with the online arbitrage experience that I've already got. And I've also got my UK bundles brand, okay, and I'm launching a private label brand. But the reason I managed to do all this stuff, guys, do multiple marketplaces with multiple strategies is because I've already put in the work. I've already put in the work. I understand arbitrage to a high level because I spent a long time doing it. I understand bundles to a high level because I've got a long time doing it. I've you know, made tens and tens and tens of thousands of profit doing it, right? And I understand now, uh, now, now I've outsourced them to to a certain level where I just do product creation now. Now I'm looking at sort of private label because I think I can start to master that. But you guessed it. If I do that, I won't be doing anything else until pri unless it's private label for the next year and a half. And then you master that. Most of you have started six months ago or a year ago and you're trying to do what I do and you're trying to have seven or eight team members that I've got. I can't remember how it is. Seven or eight team members that I've got uh, in multiple marketplaces and we spend, including our UK, six or seven thousand pounds a week, maybe eight thousand pounds a week buying stock. And I've got multiple moving parts from multiple warehouses from all over, like internationally, from the UK and the USA, doing multiple business models. And I've, I've spent years getting that together. And you think you can do it overnight. You need to focus on one, guys. 
You need to focus on one. If you're going to do bundles, do bundles. If you're going to do bundles, do bundles threes. If you're going to do bundles, do bundles fours. Like, stop thinking, oh, I'm just going to do bundles. And then what happens is you you get FOMO and you start doing, oh, but these guys are doing well in bundles twos and threes and fours and fives. I'm going to do all of them. No, no, no. If you're going to do bundles, do one bundle. Bundle option three, bundle option four, something like that. If you're going to do arbitrage, do it in one marketplace, do one strategy, okay? You're going to do a high volume, low, low margins, whatever. I promise you, if you stick to at least one of these strategies for a year or a year and a half, you're going to get really good at that and you're going to be able to compound that experience, right? <sighs> this is it, guys. Trust me, this is, the, this is the secret source of this. This is brutally honest advice, right? That I wish someone gave me, right? You're either not putting it. You're, you're either not putting enough work, or you're overwhelming yourself with too much focus and too much work that you're not getting anything nailed. Right? This is the truth of it. Right? Cool. I haven't got that out. Um, guys, if you've got any questions, make sure you jump in the Mr. Hayden uh, Facebook group, by the way, because I now have a podcast with uh, my friend Yanni, and uh, we do every single, when is it, Thursday? Every single Wednesday at 2 p.m., we do a live chat in there, and you can ask any questions as you want, and then I'll upload it to this YouTube channel after, so make sure you jump in that. There'll be a link to that below. Um, if you want to chat to, if you, look, if you want to do bundles or something, then I can refer to you, I can refer you the Hive, which is from my coach, Natalie, who trained me everything I know. If you want to do any one-to-one -one consulting with me, I've literally only just started in the four and a half years of selling, opening myself up to maybe mentoring one or two people. I'm kind of open to the idea. So if you do want to do that, then shoot me a message on Messenger or book a call with the link below. But this isn't something that's like a mainstream thing. I'm not offering this to anyone, right? We can have a chat, see if it's something you think, see if you're someone that I think I could work with. If not, then, you know, no hard feelings, guys. This isn't something I'm going to be offering as like a regular thing to anyone. This is like, you know, I'm very specific. So guys, I hope you enjoyed that. Make sure you jump in the Facebook group so we can chat in there and you can watch the live videos and I will see you in the next video.